Welcome back to another video for your soul evolution. What you believe to be true, is it true or do you just believe that it's true because you were taught that it was true and you never looked any further? Today I wanted to talk about beliefs. Did you know that your body has an electromagnetic energy that extends far out from your body through the whole entire room and even further than that? So when you are out and about at Walmart or Target or picking up groceries, you are constantly linking up with other people's thought structures and beliefs. They've also been passed down from generation to generation as we've grown up. And there are certain things in your life that if you would sit back and really explore those, you might find that they're not truly your beliefs but beliefs of others that you have accepted as your own. We are constantly creating our reality with our beliefs, our emotions, our thoughts, and our actions. So we really need to be a little more discerning about what we accept as our truth. I wanted to take weight loss just for a short example because this is something that a lot of people struggle with. Now, Weight loss is actually not so much about the what you're eating, whether or not you're exercising. It's more about your beliefs towards the weight loss process and your beliefs towards food. You've probably been told that it requires suffering and constant exercise every day and eating only salads and things that most people don't enjoy just eating. So. What I wanted to discuss today is that you can change any belief that you want to. You do not have to subscribe to anything anyone tells you. You don't have to subscribe to what I am saying to you now. You feel free to question it. The same thing can apply towards genetic and hereditary diseases that have been passed down from generation to generation. You do not have to subscribe to that either you can change your beliefs on that. Now, sometimes this is difficult because they have been passed down from so many generations that sometimes it's just easier to accept that as truth. But it's just the momentum that has built up over time. So as you continue to work through that to change your belief systems and become aware that those truly are just beliefs and there's actually no scientific backing that those things are genetic and hereditary, then you start to become empowered and gain your power back. So if this sounds interesting to you and you would like to be a part of our mastermind group to get access to longer videos, then please click the link below to join. Other than that, see you on the next video. Thank you.